Hidden Pictures for Kids. Hi, I'm Eric from Etikude and today I want to share one of the most useful resources I found when teaching English to young learners and that is Hidden Pictures. This is a fantastic source for teachers to start the class with, to get the students to settle down and for them to have fun. Pictures is actually um, a set of books by highlights. You can see it says here highlights kids and you click on that and it opens this up for you. And if you are teaching online or if you're teaching in class you can open this up to copy this and you send the URL to your students and they have to find these items. So they have to find a shoe or a carrot. So let's see. Oh, there's a carrot. I click on it and now they have a carrot. Or I need to find a slice of pizza. Oh, I found a slice of pizza. So first the students find all the hidden objects and then they have to practice pronunciation and they can practice making sentences if that is their level. If this is not an online class and you don't have the internet, you can print out these pictures. You just search for hidden pictures, go here, Ah, oh, here we can we can see some examples. After finding all these words, they can even color in this nice picture right here. What I would suggest is buying the jumbo book of hidden pictures. Here you can find all the hidden pictures. You find whatever picture you want to use, you photocopy it, and then hand it out to your students. You can see it's got so many topics you can look at, overslept, bees for busy, so many games to use. For example, here we have the bear that overslept. First, the students look for all these items and you can ask them questions about the vocabulary too. Um, what is this? It's a fish. What fish do you know? Do you like eating fish? Or you can ask them shoes. What color is your shoes? You can use this in your class and afterwards the students can color this in. I've put the link to this in the description below so you can go and buy this jumbo book of hidden pictures from there. Okay, so what did you think of these hidden pictures? It's really fun to get the students interested in class. Also, if you would like the jumbo book for hidden pictures, check the description below. I'm Eric from Etikude and I'll see you next time.